two trophies there, Kamal, huh? <laughs> yeah, you know, I got to leave with some hardware. <laughs> well, it was pretty hard to get, though, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, you know, first match came out guns blazing from all base style. Highlight reel. Wasn't smart, kind of lost. Got my shoulder tore up a little bit. Second round came out, changed up my stance a lot. And my precision, you know, technique and everything. You know, it's just what you got to do. You got to be professional now. And you got to learn from your mistakes. Well, obviously, your, your move to Colorado, how it's changed your style and, and how you feel like a better wrestler now. Colorado's been great, you know. Uh, it's been a great time for me. Uh, me and Rayvon Perkins team up and I work out with him. Happy he made the Olympic team. Shout out Rayvon. Uh, overall, you know, it's been increasing my lungs. You know, TC has me walking the incline, training in back row, running in the morning, doing ropes and everything, man. You know, it's really, really helped me out a lot, even in school and everything. So talk a little bit about the world championship. Obviously, that's a goal of yours, and now you have an opportunity to represent your country. What kind of goals have you set, and what kind of what do you feel about that opportunity? Well, when I put that USA on my back, it's going to be real. You know, it's nothing better than representing your country as one of the best at the weight, at the style, you know. So, you know, I'm going to come out. It's going to be showtime, man. It's showtime. I'm training right now. No off days. You got to get ready for this. This is serious now. Now, you're good at freestyle, too, and folk style. Are you just Greco only now? I mean, or what's, what's it look like ahead? You know, I don't really train freestyle or folk style that much, you know, but I'll scrap with anybody, so if you want to train, you know, I'm, I'm about it. <laughs> <laughs> so, so talk about, you know, being able to, to clinch your spot on the world team and going to France. What are you looking forward to? What kind of goals do you have set for uh, I'm looking forward to messing with uh, my boy Nick Green a lot. You know, he's a goofy Texas kid, man. So, you know, me from the city, I like to mess with people. And uh, I'm looking forward to the training, meeting the new people and stuff. Because went to Europe once, you know, only black guy, they loved me, man. It was like I was ushered. <laughs> but I couldn't sing, though. I couldn't sing. So that's always good. I'm not looking forward to the plane ride. That's going to be horrible. But, you know, <laughs> it's all the experience. That's all you can get. So, Dom, you feel, uh, based on your performance, that you were the outstanding guy there. I mean, were you able to show what you had with, uh, with a really good opponent? You know, losing first round in the two, best out of two out of three. You know, losing the first one and coming back and winning two, that, that really showed my heart, really showed my character. And show you what I've been through because Jesse Porter, he's a, he's a tough opponent, as you can see. But, you know, I switched up my style. You know, I had to respect that he had a nice arm spin. And, you know, I came up with the win. Congratulations, Kamal. Great job. Thank you, thank you.